Oh, it is Monday, January 15th, half the month gone. Ah, oh, man. January 15th, 2018. Man. Less than 21 days ago, we were celebrating Christmas. We're already halfway through the month of January, and good things just keep happening. Uh, let's go see what kind of week we got out here or day we start with. Of course, it's National Strawberry Ice Cream Day. And we know that today is Martin Luther King Jr. Day. But did you also know that it's National Hat Day? How do you celebrate National Hat Day? Wear a hat. Or, as you can see over my shoulder, I have some other hats. As if you look over all the way down, and let me just adjust this a little bit. I have those hats. I have those hats. I have hats over there. I have hats all over the place. So you're a little behind National Hat Day. Anyway, out there. I decided that we needed a quote. A different quote. Life's most persistent and urgent question is, what are you doing for others? Martin Luther King Jr. Somebody looked at me and said, what are you doing for others? And I said, what have you done for yourself? Now, I'm not trying to be selfish, and I'm not trying to take anything away from Martin Luther King Jr., but you can't truly do anything for others until you've straightened yourself up and got yourself okay. You see, it's got to be okay in the heart and got to be okay inside. Now the reason I bring this up is I see a bunch of people nagging. Oh, I sent out a bomb and they didn't post it. So? I sent out a cigar bomb and nobody said anything about it. So? Long as it got there, long as the tracking number said sign for, put in the mailbox, whatever, a cigar bomb is a gift. You don't need to be publicized about it. You don't need to have somebody post about it. You don't need to have a public thank you. And sometimes you don't even get a thank you because the people don't understand. So what? If you really need that, that publicity, that information, the thank you, oh, post it on Facebook, post it on Instagram, post it on Snapchat, post it, post it, post it. I send out about five bombs a week for cigar bombs going out, and I don't care if they're posted or not. In fact, I try to find people that are always on Facebook to send them a gift like that because I care about how others are doing, not about the publicity it will get me. So what are you doing for others? What are you doing for others and acting like you're doing for others even when the publicity and cameras and everything else aren't looking at you? Mm-hmm. Exactly. Who are you doing cigar bombs for? You or somebody else to help them out? And if you're doing it for you and the glory, you're an empty person. Anyway, 
I know I'm going to get in trouble. That's just the fact, Jack. Anyway. Yeah, that's a full body cast bone shaker. About a 98 on the 0 to 100, mild to full, full be it. A full, 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 full being 100. This is so close to 100, sometimes I think it's a 100. It has a good pepper background of spice, but it also has a awesome sweetness to it. Not sickening, sugary sweet, but like a hay or a grass or alfalfa sweet. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm. It has been known to turn a few heads, Kibby. It is raw power as some one person said I say it's raw strength it's one of those Maduro cigars that if you never smoked one first of all you don't smoke it on an empty stomach second of all when you do smoke it you definitely got to sit there and enjoy it because it's got some intense flavors and smells oh, and the tobacco smell is phenomenal that's right this is the mall m-a-u-l mall full body cast bone shaker about 350 a stick not a bad stick not a bad price it's one that will fit most budgets so get out there get a stick or two buy a box or two I keep at least a box in here you see there's some mooch that shows up all the time named Kippy and that's the only thing he wants to smoke his full body cast bone shakers so Anyway, yeah, Bone Shakers on Monday and Kippy. Tacos on Tuesday with Martin. Throwback Thursday for Trailer Park. I mean, God, it's getting to the point where, you know, way out Wednesdays turn out to be Sam days. And it just gets to the point where I'm looking forward to Friday. So, anyway out there, guys, we love you. We care about you. Don't forget, we got a hearth coming up February 4th, Super Bowl for the Water Buffaloes. Get out there. Have yourself a hearth attack. Mm-hmm. Smoked brisket, smoked turkey, and a whole lot of other goodies. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, and I've had a couple of good hearths like that, and I'm still dropping weight because we being healthy conscious at the hearths too. Ain't heard nobody turn down nothing yet. Anyway, out there, find a cigar like a bone shaker that you really like and smoke what you like, like what you smoke, and above all, kick some ash. <laughs>